Right, so here we are. We've got, um, well, in fact, I say, we've got this tube that runs right through the keel to this point where it's got a join in it, and then it joins another tube that's part of this, the keel. And what we've done is we've drilled this hole that goes through into the void for the around the pin. So the pin's sitting in another tube in the inside of the um, a vessel. But what we're doing is we just need to, through this tube, just inject a West system epoxy. So what we're going to do is we're using a syringe to slowly inject the epoxy into there, down to bond, not the pin through the middle, but the outer of the pin. I know this all looks messy at the moment, but we're not worried about that. That all's going to be sanded off. So what we want is we need the support tube to be absolutely rigid. And through that tube, we can put the epoxy down through it. I can't do it with holding the phone and doing it. So I'm literally going to inject the epoxy down to there to fill that tube inside and make it, well, surround that tube and make it absolutely solid. That's kind of one of the um, points of uh, um, reinforcing all the keel and everything. But um, they've... Um, Epoxy's got some fibres in it to make it really solid, and now um, I'm just going to epoxy that in. Right, so as you can see, I've actually managed to set it up. So the epoxy's in my little pot here. Syringe it in. Now it would have been better if I'd had a bigger syringe, but I couldn't find one. They are here somewhere, but couldn't find one. Can't go and buy one. There, you are. there goes another one in. Got to repeat this a lot of times. Right, so most of that pot has now gone in here. So let me just put the last one in. Got a bit messy now, but never mind. Right, there it is. The last one in there. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to inject a little bit of air just to push all the epoxy down into it. I can see the air bubble going down. That's it. Done. Sorted. So that now I'll leave a, a little pot to make sure that everything's gone off nicely so that I know when it's gone off. And now that tube is just going to stay there until that epoxy goes completely solid in there. And then tomorrow, I'll be able to take the boat out, put it in a suitable position, pull the huge long pin out the bottom, about a meter long, um, pull that out, take the keel out, and then fill the rest of the hole from inside, and then tidy up all these bits. But um, that's it for today.